Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Chronicles with Grover Games. So we're still on the same day recording the episode and I remembered that someone was telling me about this game that we can get a Hoenn starter and we're supposed to get in the Goldenrod sewers somewhere so we're gonna head back here quick and we're gonna check it out actually. Because I think that I may have broken the game somehow. Because supposedly we're supposed to like meet up with someone. Up. Oh. Okay, so when I I guess when I used dig I bypassed everything and I I didn't realize that I Came here because someone reported that team rocket was here. We were able to catch some of them We'll ask them some questions later I remember I clearly told you to keep off team rocket and you continue facing them You know what professors oak and elm told me about you. You're not a common trainer this time I'll trust you to help us to catch all the team rocket and give you a number you can contact me as I just have my back towards, I'm ignoring him. Remember, I gave you confidential information and you must keep the secret about yourself, about this. Only you are allowed to contact me. I'll return to the police station. I'll need to evaluate the evidence I just found here today. I expect to hear from you again. No, look, the way I, the way they have looker her work, I'm still just ignoring everyone here. I love it. I, I just imagine, like, Looker's much more of a harder copier than he was in, like, the original games he was introduced. We came here alongside the police because some people saw you when you entered here, and I was worried about you. I see you're strong enough to take care of yourself. Ha 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 ha. Well, GG, I see you're a reliable person. You have potential and you're able to take care of any Pokemon. That's why as a gift for your victory against Team Rocket, I'll give you a rare Pokemon from the- Ooh! You can pick one of the Pokemon I have in my bag. Come on, GG, choose one. So I'm still gonna keep with the trend of this playthrough. Um, I'm gonna be using like odd Poke Pokemon I haven't ever really used before. And I've used Torch Torchic and Mudkip a lot when I played this game. So Treacle is what we're gonna be going for, unfortunately. I shouldn't say unfortunately. Treacle can't be that bad of a Pokemon. And if we get Megas in here, I I think a Mega Treacle Mega. Was it Sceptile? Yeah, Sceptile would be awesome. Um, I think we're gonna name him Gex. Yeah, we're gonna name him Gex. And if you get the reference to that, that let me know. I know you'll raise this Pokemon, and maybe we will learn about it. Okay, it's time to go. I will stay a couple days more in Johto. I will record some radio programs with Professor Oak and DJ Mary. Take care, Gigi. Well, it's a good thing we... I remember someone telling me that. It's a good thing we came back here. <laughs> Gosh, it just looks like Gex is just flailing it, flapping his arms really fast to try and fly. Oh, wow. He's got S tier in attack and special attack. I'm trying to remember. I think, like, Vegas Septile is a special attacker, ain't it? I think so. The only thing that's unfortunate is his speed, but he's already, like... He's already generally usually a faster type Pokemon too. Um, but we're gonna keep Gex for now. I I think I'm gonna try and include him on the final team if I can help it, but we'll see what happens down the road here. And while we're here, I'm gonna finally break down and buy uh Clefairy. Uh, oh, we're gonna pick up that dazzling gleam TM. TM. It's she definitely needs a fairy type move. I can't remember if we gotta go all the way upstairs for it, or is it over here? I think it's over here. Nope. You got all the stones. Which I don't need any right now, which is a good feeling. What do you have to sell? Uh, safeguard, Hyper Beam, Leech Fang, Flash Can. Oh, uh, that's a lot of money to drop, but I think it'll be worth it in the end. Uh, da -da. So let's get hurt. Let's get gum taught gla- Let's get dazzling gleam taught to gum jeepers. English is hard for me today, folks. I'm sorry. Uh, and Maximus can learn it too, apparently. And I think we're gonna get rid of defense curl. I don't see it being too much use more useful for us. And we're still gonna hang on to Encore. I think we can get some use out of it 
but we just haven't had a very good opportune moment for it. I think the more more of the reason why we haven't really had an opportune moment is because we haven't really gotten any setup moves for anyone on our team yet. So let's let's keep moving along here. Also, I'm wondering, is this still going to be the normal gym? Incredibly pr pretty girl. Let's just go in here quick and ask. Yo, champ in the making. Wouldn't he specialize in the super cute fairy Pokemon? You shouldn't underestimate their power. Take this fresh water. Okay, so they did change her typing to fairy type. I was wondering if that was what, what was going to happen. Well, let's get out of here for now. Well, if she's got fairy typing, I wonder if her whole team's gonna be working, if that dang mill tank's gonna be gone. Um, and I know we have Sludge Bomb. Do we have anyone that can learn Sludge Bomb? Uh, that's kind of what I thought. Unfortunately, no. But you know what? We're gonna spend today doing the bug catching contest. This, I figure we'll at least explore the area, see, see what we can find there, and maybe we'll find someone to replace Shogun, maybe? Because if... If Whitney's got bug type Pokemon, I kind of wouldn't mind finding something. Oh. Finding something that we can get a poison type. Um. I'm trying to think. Do we bring gum or do we bring Cynthia? I mean. Gum's got a little bit actually better defense to her, and then she's got leftovers and cute charm, so she gets hit. We got Sing and Encorn, so maybe I think we I think we bring gum. I mean, today's Tuesday. That means it's a bug catching po the the bug catching contest. The rules are simple: using one of your Pokemon catch a bug type to be judged. Yes. Uh, we're I'm gonna still stick with gum. Just putting love leftovers on her, and just the fact that she's got a good amount of bulk to her. You have only one opportunity to catch a bug Pokemon. If you run out of Pokeballs, ask the guard to get some more po park balls. Once you catch a Pokemon, the kind. Wait. Are you sure you want to leave? No. I was just curious. Because they worded it weird. So do we only really have one opportunity to catch... Uh... Oh, so we're using our own Pokeballs here. That's interesting. I, um, what do you have to say? Okay. Okay, I think, I think that's how this is going to be. I think it's going to, it's only going to be, oh, now let's turn off auto run. I wonder if that's gonna give us actually That's my question too. Where's the poke gear? Can we use Dex Nav in here to stag different Pokemon? We can Interesting Okay I wonder if we can uh, so let's try that again. Let's we'll see if we can... Did I get to it or did I just... Nope, I got unlucky again. Oh, I hate you so much. Because I honestly... I honestly wouldn't mind using a pincer. I haven't used a pincer in a long time. There we go. O13 Pincer. And he's got Mold Breaker. Okay, that's actually a fairly good ability. Let's see if we one-shot it with Hidden Power. Because so I think the other ability it gets is Swarm. I'm almost certain it's Swarm. Um... I was going to say, well... Ooh. I do not like Seismic Toss. I 
Okay, so we're good there now. We'll throw some sport balls at it. We'll see what happens. If I don't feel like it's very high level, but we're still gonna go for it. The alarm pincer horns are power powerful. Once they grip an enemy, they won't release until the foe, foe is torn. Uh. Oh, what do I want to name him? Hmm. Uh, shoot. What do I want to name him? It's gonna bug me. I don't know. I don't know what I want to name Pincer right now. I should have been thinking about this a, a while back. Uh. Uh, we'll go with Uther. Uther the Pincer. Congratulations, all contents. Okay, so that is, that is how it works. That you only get to catch one. Apparently the kid to the far left is naked and they're blocking it. Tabulation is finished and we can now reveal the scores. With 84 points says Jamie. A citrus berry. 162 points, okay. One ever. That is like the most useless item ever. Get that away from me. Apparently Riley has one point. How does he win with one point? And I got a citrus. Okay. You know what? I'm fine with the citrus. I'd rather have the citrus berry instead of the Everstone, unfortunately. So do we gotta re... Yes, we do. And it's got a bold nature. That's... That's unfortunate for us. I think we're just gonna put Uther in the box. We're gonna get the original team back out. I'm not... I'm not gonna... You'll notice I won't be editing my card here, because I didn't realize, I'm, I was hoping the whole party would be back in here normally. But I think we might do some switch training on Gex here. We'll go, uh, we'll go back to the previous rounds, get some, hopefully get some levels on him. Our box is looking pretty, pretty bare yet for Pokemon opportunities. I also realized that a lot the couple episodes ago when I was putting disappoint, I spelt it wrong. I was trying to fit it all, like put mint at the end and I'm like, ah, I don't I don't care anymore. I'm not gonna use it. Um The only one I was kinda thinking about using was over easy, but Yeah, he's He's not too great right now. Maybe I'll maybe I'll decide to use him later, but I doubt it. Like I said, I kind of want to make make this playthrough more about... Yo, what are you doing here? Okay, I didn't know if we could fight these guards during the day. So back to what I was saying. I kind of lost my train of thought, to be honest with you there. I don't... I just don't... I view Tor use Torkus enough in other games, I don't really want to use it here. And I'm trying to, like I said, I'm trying to use Pokemon I haven't really used before, and Gex is actually going to be, like, Trico, I think, is going to be a fun one to use. Especially when we get Mega Evolutions, I wonder, I wonder how soon we can get his Mega Stone and such. I wonder when you even do get Mega Evolutions. So far, the, I've enjoyed, like, the little tidbits plots of, of how they brought in, like, Professor Birch and such, and everything else so far. Puccina. Oh, well, that's unfortunate for you, bud. You finally got a fairy move. There we go. We got gum another level. So, I'm wondering... So, if Whitney's completely fairy type now, I'm curious what her team is actually going to be like, because it could actually be pretty terrifying when you sit there here and think about it, because there's... There's so many, like... I know a lot... There's... Eh, 
there's like mixed opinions on people with the fairy typing, but I think it was a much needed typing. In the game, like, I felt like Poison and Steel needed something to be super effective against, and it makes sense, and I felt like it kind of helped balance dragons out a little more. A report sent to us state that Team Rocket is back. We must be awake, waking all day and night. Too bad you guys suck at your job, though. I like to make references to the pop culture. Don't we all, kid? Don't we all? Youngster's gonna send out a side duck. Can you do this, Gex? Well, we're gonna try. I mean, he does- he does have, like, maxed out attack and special attack, which, like, for IVs, which is actually really good. Like, we could actually make him a mix attacker if we want, I'm guessing. But, let's see. Oh god. Please don't. Thank you. I just want to get get some, get some levels, man. There we go. And a Nuzleaf, so... Uh, Gum actually will be really good for this with the... Oh, I should have switched to Cynthia. I got her another level. It's fine. I think Nuzleaf gives... Defense EVs anyway, and that'll be pretty good for gum. Uh, let's Dazzle Gleam you. So if she, if Whitney is a fairy type, what, what is the TM she's gonna be give, handing over to us when we eventually beat her? Mega Drain. Oh, sweet. Yeah, let's, let's get that, bud. Let's get rid of that. I, I'm a head out. <laughs> uh, such a great SpongeBob meme. My baby Pokemon enjoying battling close to the sea. See, it's a good thing we left these trainers behind. Um, shoot. I'm hoping we can. Oh gosh, that did not do hardly any damage. I think we're just gonna pull Gex out for now. We'll send in Gum again. Actually, I should see what hidden power is on Gex since he's still a little bit. Granted, he's still low enough and his stacks are close enough that I know physical and special split moves don't really matter for him yet, but I should see what hidden power he learns. Uh, we're gonna bring back Gex back out because I'm kind of hoping we there might be enough baby Pokemon here that we could get quite a few levels just just on him. Um, hopefully he doesn't hurt himself. Ah, uh, you. Um, as I say, we'll try one more attack and see what happens. I'm pretty sure a peony should be like, yeah, I was gonna say, super specially defensive. Um, we'll try pound again. I feel like. Oh, I feel like we sh I was gonna say, I thought we'd be getting out of confusion here soon, but we. Been fortunate enough that we haven't hit ourselves several times. Granted, our attack has been completely lowered. Mantic. Okay. Uh, let's Mega Drain that. Wow, these things. All these. All these Pokemon have really high special defenses. Holy cow. Um, let's, let's bring back out Gum.
Just because I know Gum's got decent defense. And we'll just... We'll hit him power flying him. I finally get it a fairy type move and I never use it. So this Mantike has... Fuse Ray, Supersonic. He's just trying to be a troll. Uh, so we'll... Oh, uh, that's unfortunate, but we'll just... We'll quick attack him. Hopefully that takes it out. Nope, it doesn't. Uh, we'll just quick attack again. There we go. And what else you got in your party? Smooch him. Um... I feel like... I can't remember if, like, the Smooch him Jinx line has a lot of... special defense, but... If I keep getting confused at this rate, I'm gonna just... I'm getting irked. So this trainer is slowly irking me. I didn't think about Powder Snow. I should've... should've. Oh, you! Oh, that actually, that actually upsets me greatly now. I am gonna burn all of your children now. You have no idea. I, I, that was an untimely crit. I'm pretty sure that mattered. Granted, it doesn't. It do, it's not like the end of the world type thing. It's just unfortunate now because we're not going to be getting experience on Gex. Woo! Actually, I should have used hidden power fighting. I was going to say, he probably has thick fat. Big old little boy like him. Uh, yep. Yeah, let's go with hidden power fighting. Well, he's also a special defensive tank too, so... Oh yeah, he definitely had th had to have thick fat there. Okay. Well, I got I gotta remember to keep riding my bike. You know, advertisement, whatnot for the guy. Um, let's go in here. So with that Dex Nav, if we go to the Pokemon bug catching contest, we could get free stones all the time. Especially with the way you can just hunt down the specific Pokemon. That's actually, I'm just, I don't know why that thought came back to me. It actually wouldn't be a bad thing for me to do in my off time. Um, oh yeah, right. I was gonna check to see Or, he can't learn Sludge Bomb, right? I'm sure he can't. Yes, he can't. Okay, that's what I figured. Can he learn U-Turn, though? No. That's unfortunate for us. Um, what about Snarl? Can you learn that? No. Uh... Where's Hidden Power? There we go. Let's see what your Hidden Power is, bud. Hidden Power Bug! Okay. That's actually not, I don't think that's too bad. Let's get rid of Pound. I don't think Hidden Power Bug is that bad. Bad, Not great, but I I don't think it's the worst thing he could have gotten for a Hidden Power. I'm trying to think what I would have rather had instead of Hidden Power Bug. Hmm, I'm trying to think. Ice wouldn't have been bad. Hidden Power Fire wouldn't have been bad. Uh, let's switch into gum. Oh, that's gonna be this game, huh? I was gonna say, good thing I have someone with a move that can never miss and I realize it's, it's a normal type move. <laughs>
That's what I'm trying to think. Oh, come on, Clefairy. Come on, just hit- just hit this thing. Please. It only minimized once, though, too. That's the worst part right now. Oh my lord! This is gonna drive me nuts! There we go, finally! Now kill it, at least. Thank you! Um... Yeah, let's go ahead and power flying. I mean, I wasn't really planning on switching out right now. Because really, it, do it doesn't make sense for me to bring in... Well, it does make sense bring me have guests come in to get some... EVs and special attack, but it's not worth the time in switching right now. Plus, Lord knows all the EV... All the... All the EV spreads are going to be really bad on everyone anyways. There we go. Get my re salty revenge on this thing. For that dang Drifum. Right, get out of here, lady. Then I think we only got like two trainers left to fight around here. Well, I never noticed the water sound effects when she came up walking. That's actually cool. When I grow up, I like to be an important but on authority. Bleh. Sharon. She has a Badoo. Um, let's put the hidden power bug to use. That did not do that much damage. I'm hoping the Badoo doesn't have a poison attack. It probably has poison sting. But I'm hoping it doesn't have something crazy like Sludge or Sludge Bomb. And I don't really want to quick attack it just cause... Well, I don't want to get- I don't want to accidentally get poisoned. That did pretty good damage, but she does have three attack ups. Yeah, I think she had three girls set up. What's next? A Bulbasaur. Well, I... Do we... I'm like, how long do I keep Gex in? Oh, that was a crit. That was unfortunate. That was also a crit to me. Um, let's... Okay. A Sun Kern. Well, actually something that would have been... <laughs> taken super effective damage from and in power. There we go. Like, Hidden Power Bug isn't bad, but I I feel like there could have been a better one we could have gotten. I just don't know what I would have wanted. And a Bulbasaur again. Uh, are you going to switch out again? I mean, they're doing about the same amount of damage. Quick attack and whatchamacallit, Hidden Power Bug. Woo! That's interesting to see. Well, let's just hit and power bug that. Oh, that's... That's kind of unfortunate for us, but... You know, and we still got... Actually, we still got one more place we can kind of switch train Gex. I forgot, we didn't beat anyone in the park, National Park, either. Uh... I think hit and power bug is just going to be the best option. Especially since we had our attack lowered already. We're almost level 16, so we're about- we're getting close to getting Grovile. I think that's how you pronounce it, right? Camera, did I fight you, kid? No. Alright, we're gonna fight you and that's- I think this is where we're gonna finish everything. For some reason I thought we fought this kid. Sentry, okay. Okay, I'm a little scared. Do I take the chance? No. I don't want to. Um... I don't want to take the chance. 
I was gonna Mega Drain get our health back, but I think that Sentret will. Okay. I was I was I was counting on quick quick attack for it to. Yeah, I was counting on it to use quick attack instead of fury swipes. But we still got Gex's level, so we'll he'll be evolving at the end of this episode. So. Cack and I. So one of the times where hit hand and power bug would have been used. Uh, I think we'll just keep in Maximus for now since we got, since we got Gex his level now. I'm not gonna worry about switching him back in for now. Granted, we're just pretty much slaughtering everything since we're like way over leveled now with everything else. I've been defeated so many times that it doesn't hurt anymore. That sounds like depression, kid. I think this is our first... No, this will be our second on-screen evolution. I, I say the other two evolutions I've done, I did off-screen grinding. We got ourselves a grow vial already. Just trying to learn Fury Cutter. Um... You know what? I really don't want to. Yeah, because I feel like... I kind of want to make Grovile a special attacker, especially if I'm thinking about using Mega Sceptile, because I think Mega Sceptile usually is heavier on special attack, ain't he? Yeah, I'm almost certain he is. I mean, even having really bad, like, IV and speed, he's still got... he's still pretty dang fast, but... This is where we're gonna lit. I think this is where we're gonna stop today's episodes. Every today's episode, excuse me, everyone. Uh, if, you, if you enjoyed today's episode, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel. If you're enjoying the content, please subscribe so you can stay up to date to the latest series. Above all else, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day. And most of all, thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.